Hello, I'd like to share with you the journey of how I made the decision to isolate myself in seventh grade. Sixth grade was pretty normal, meeting new people, figuring myself out, good grades, getting ready for seventh grade. I sat down to write a list on how we can make the upcoming school year great. This is something we do every year, so we take the time to think about how to improve our grades, how to make new friends, and how to become a bigger and better person. I got comfortable into my seventh grade year, I noticed that something was off. I felt like I didn't have any people on my side, and everyone was acting really weird. Most kids didn't really like me for who I was and how I looked anymore. I started to feel bad about everything, and it took, and I took it as if I was the problem at the time. By the middle of seventh grade, I didn't really want to confess it, but I was getting bullied. I'm not good at talking about things, so instead I started showing out and making poor decisions. I put, my, I put stress on my parents and myself as well. At one point, my grade starting, started to fail, and I didn't know what to do anymore. The bullying got so bad to the point where I felt it coming. I always knew something, someone was on the verge of saying something about me. I would feel tight inside, and I would be on the edge of crying, but I couldn't because I didn't want anyone to show me any sympathy. My best friends, siblings, teachers always asked me questions like, what's going on with you, or you're not acting like you anymore. I didn't, I didn't tell anyone what was going on because I basically looked at, they basically looked at me as a troublemaker. My school year made me feel as if I wasn't me anymore. Everything I didn't want happened. <laughs> and I always felt like I was trying, but I knew I wasn't. Everything I did, it... <laughs> but at the end of my seventh grade year, I finally got up one day and had the motivation to stop everything, stop everything bad from happening that was going on. I woke up and told myself that it's time to focus on me and what's right and how can I improve myself. I took the time to sit down and think about everything and I had the idea, the idea came into my head that I should withdraw and take a break from everyone and everything. It was time to focus on myself. I spent a lot of time to be my own best friend. I took myself on walks, I looked, in my, I looked at myself in the mirror and said positive affirmations. I started to heal. It was the end of the year and I decided to write down my list for eighth grade. My decision was to keep focusing on myself and stay isolated from the negative talk around me. I was tired of feeling like I wasn't enough because I'm beautiful and I'm strong. The beginning of my eighth grade year, everything went as planned. Things still weren't perfect, but they calmed down. I didn't have any friends but my best friend. I isolated myself so bad to the point where I didn't even eat in the same lunch area as everyone else. I was okay with that though. I didn't have any drama or any problems with that concerned other people. I felt better in the classroom. I didn't feel tight anymore. I would see any, I, I wouldn't feel tight whenever I see someone walk past me. I didn't give them power anymore. Kids would come up and ask me, how come you don't talk to me anymore? Or why did you change? People would call me names like Stuck Up or Hollywood because I wanted to be alone and I wanted to do things my own way. I didn't care about the names anymore because I was in the process of figuring out who I am and how I wanted to live. After the bullying died down, I noticed my worth again. I noticed that I stand out more and I'm great just the way I am. I'm a natural introvert and a middle child. I don't look for attention, so, I found a routine that worked for me. Now it's my eighth grade year and due to COVID, I have to stay home anyway. I feel my isolation during this, la during the past two years actually prepared me for this year better than I imagined. Because I took the time to focus on me. I can stay strong during, the, during this difficult time. I can continue to be my own best friend. And when things get rough, I am not afraid to look in the mirror and tell myself I am strong and I am beautiful. I am done.